Hey guys, welcome to part 6 of my tutorial for Real Flows in You. And in this part, I'm gonna show you how to play the left and right hand together of this part. Alright, so it's gonna be pretty easy, it's just difficult to play it really fast with the right hand like this. But putting them together is actually really easy. So we'll start on this. Okay, you start with your right hand just normal playing A, B, A, G sharp, A. And on the third A, you will start with your left hand. So. Alright, the next note, the C sharp with your left hand, is going to be played on the E with your right hand. So like this. Alright, and the next note, the F sharp with your left hand, is going to be played on the next A with your right hand. Alright, so. Alright, and the last C sharp, this one, is played on the second A of your right hand. So again. Alright, one more time, really slowly. Alright, now on the third A, you go down to the next chord. Alright, and then the same. On the same notes, you will just play the same with your left hand, alright? Alright, and now to the third part. So as you can see, you start again on the third A with your right hand, and then the next note will be on the C sharp with your right hand, so like this. Alright. And then the next C sharp with your left hand will be played on the E with your right hand. Alright. Alright. And then the last E with your left hand for this chord will be played on the B with your right hand. Alright. So one last time the third chord with your right hand. Alright, and then it goes to the fourth chord with your left hand, which is this one. And you hit this E on the G sharp. Alright. Then you go with your right hand to the B and with your left hand also. Alright. And now when your left hand hits this G sharp, you will already start with the next uh, thing with your right hand. Alright. on the first and second A. And now when it reaches the third A, you just start again. Alright, now the last time you play it, so you had this once, one octave lower then, so it will sound like this. And 
now it changes. Instead of playing just and then continue, you will play this. So once the two together, then both hands go down to E and G sharp. And then your left hand hits the E once more. And that's the final note. All right. So let's go through that one more time. And don't worry about the two times playing this. It just stays exactly the same. Always on the third A. And as you can see, it just stays exactly the same. You hit the B on the E just with this little in between. All right. The rest stays exactly the same. So. And that's the end. All right, so I will play to you one more time really slowly, but if you don't need to watch that again, you can just go to the next part. I will add a link. And if you want to listen to it one more time and see every single note really slowly so that you definitely get it, then you can watch this now. If not, then thanks for watching and see you in the next part. If you do want to watch it, here it is. All right, sorry, I had a little mistake in the end, but I think you got the rest. Okay, so thank you for watching and hope you subscribe and like and favorite like always and comment and write me everything. And yeah, see you in the next part where I will show you how to play this part. Which is really really easy so um hope you enjoyed watching and i'll see you in the next part